Yeah, <gasps> welcome to the latest <laughs> episode of The Altar, where we have, uh, I'm, dude, I'm going to be black soon, I'm telling you. Whoa. Look at dark. There. Uh, you so you look like a slightly horned marshmallow. Yeah, dude. Well, it's like it's light. It's yeah. make you, like super light. So uh, we got me. Sir, can we, see, uh, can we see your passport real quick? No. Your my, papers? Yeah, my papers say uh, Abu Mahati. That's for Admiral. I don't even know how one could show their passport without showing like all their personal information, so I'm good. So obviously, I actually have them right next to me. Got Yamura. And, <laughs> how do I um, block almost this entire thing just to show you? Your block what? Please don't. Please I don't actually have my passport right next to me. I look so bad in it. <laughs> Why do you just have your passport? Like I have it right next to me in my desk. Look at is that in case like SWAT bust then? Passport. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> so like, remember the so Fed when I was when I was setting this up, right? The worst like, one. I have the the screen up on my second monitor, so I have to keep looking over there like a jackass because it looked fucked up on my main one, but I didn't have time to fix it. I'm gonna be looking off to the side a lot and probably sound like shit. Uh, maybe, you know, maybe I'll fix it. Right you now. sound fine. Maybe I'll fix it right now. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna brick the screen. I'm gonna brick it. Because I can. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, we're good. The screen. <laughs> now we're good. So, uh, anyways, the mask, the anti maskers won. It only took a year and two months. But we did it. Are you guys happy? Are you happy that we did that? I am. I, I was playing GTA the other night. day, and there was an ad in it called Couples Cuck Therapy. In what? In GTA. Based. I believe that. I, ha- I just It was just in my head for the last, like, two hours. I, was, I played it a little bit, <laughs> and I was like, that sounds like an awful idea, but it sounds like something that should probably be real for, for some of these people out here. I know it has nothing to do with what you just said, but I thought I'd just throw a wrench immediately in the beginning. Yeah, I appreciate it. As I knock my mouth <laughs> Immediate derailment. <laughs> Want to get a, a you know a speed run on this one. Dude, it was, it, it was a speed run. Fuck you. Hey, so man. I went to a grocery store last night and did not wear a mask at all. And there's lots of people who still like are choosing to wear masks, obviously. Mm-hmm. And they are so fucking butthurt that Dude, people are walking dude, around with no masks. I don't, I, I don't get it because you can it. still wear yours. No one's really stopping you. Again, exactly, like, 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 <laughs> like you know, certain places, like a medical place. I can understand that. I, I can get that. I can get a medical place. It makes sense. Sure, but if I go to like a bar or club, like I, I'm in New York, so it's still pretty stringent with the masks overall. Not completely, but like if I go to a bar or a club or certain places that are more that kind of vibe. They don't care. Mm-hmm. Don't give a shit. Go to a restaurant, like, maybe. If you're raw dogging okay. your bros, you don't need a mask. Okay. I, well, that or that's already. Be... I'm already built different, so it's fine. Built different. I, I am, as they say, privileged in that case. Is it so? Is it ba- so? Ben, I assume it's bad by you in Utah. Like, is it like a fifty-fifty split? Oh, bad is in like maskers. Yeah. So like it's it depends on where you are. Like if you're up in Salt Lake County, kind of yes. But if you're down in Utah County, like I can go pretty much anywhere. And I, even before the mandate was really lifted, I could have not worn a mask and probably been okay. Huh. Like most people were so ready to end it. And like, I'm, I, people who continue to wear a mask are kind of getting like stared at. <laughs> well, it's funny. It's all, it's all about the social dynamics. Mm-hmm. Dude, I like that. Uh, well, I mean, before, like, what I could do is most stores by me, obviously, I'm in the south. I just walk in. They have they have the signs up because, and everyone says, we only have the signs up because the governor makes us. It's like, we don't care. <laughs> That's basically, mm-hmm. except for, like, Walmart, right? They're like, well, we didn't, because I walked, because I walked in one time, and the person at the door was like, oh, do you, like, do you need a mask? I'm like, well, I have one in my pocket, but I'm like, do I really need to wear one? She's like, well, they would like you to. And I was like, I was gonna tell her like I'm like well then I'm not gonna wear one but my wife was like just put it on just put it on I was like fine damn it so I like I do that but most of the time around here is like every place you can go in just don't you don't even have to put it on this entire time this entire pandemic like they weren't enforcing shit maybe maybe for That's like good. a month maybe but I don't know because I was fucking living inside the house redoing everything and um. But no, like, but what you could do at Walmart was just get the mask at the door from them. Be like, oh, cool, thanks. And then walk in and put it in your pocket. 
Like they didn't. <laughs> they didn't make you wait to put it on. Free mask. Just, the, just free mask. The police. It's free mask. And I th- I threw them out of the car on the way home so I could help with pollution. <laughs> that's a big deal. Fuck the environment. Fuck <laughs> Earth. So no, like that was like so was, like, that was funny because like that was like there's no I don't even need to hide it and I'm not getting my satisfaction satisfaction that's not even a word. I'm not getting satisfaction. I'm not getting my satisfaction. Oh, we didn't even do Craig. Oh, right. So oh, oh fuck Craig. Craig. Yeah, Craig. We're doing it without Craig. Craig. Sucks. I actually don't think we really need Craig to be honest. But uh, well, with YouTube as a backup, you really don't. I've I've been recording a backup too, so. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Well, in that case. Um, yeah, well, I'm going to do it still. Anyways, um, no, like, it's like I, no, one, no one asks you around here about your, about your masks. And it's no, fuck it. Oh, they so, just go loud on you? That's what I, I yeah. do it purposely for you. Um, <laughs> give me, give me a I thought I have Craig muted so it doesn't bother you. Whatever. It is muted, but I think it just does that Discord join sound. And because I'm uh, not enabled. Oh, computers, yes, that's I, what you I, get I, for having your stuff enabled. But no, dude. So like, I, I just, I'm at I'm at Walmart settings. today, uh, cause I had to get cause we I finished cause I was doing like the deck stuff. I was like, well, the the play the playhouse whatever thing outside. Uh, the, I put the slide up yesterday, and I made a ladder today that kids don't even use. That's uh, pretty baller, by the way. Thank you. It's my wife's idea. <laughs> of she was like, check this out on Pinterest. I'm like, oh god, here we go again. <laughs> Um, yeah, she my... just finds the article on Pinterest, and you have to assemble the fucking structure. Of course. <laughs> well, 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 no, like the the main structure was already there. I just had to add like the the ladder because it was like a straight oh, up ladder okay. before. We'll get it, we'll get it later. But uh, I want I want I, I took uh, my oldest with me to Walmart to get because I had to get because uh, we replaced the faucet upstairs today too, and I need to get like clear sealant because I couldn't use putty because it was plastic. I guess that's a big thing you can't do or something. I don't know. I follow the instructions. Went to Walmart, no mask, with my son. And everyone's like, oh my god, your son's so handsome. Like, I know, he's got my genetics. Right? Very base, very right build. <laughs> and then on the, inter- on the intercom, at first I thought it was like a recording. No, it was something like live, dude. Like, hey everybody, everyone here, just let you know, we have we have COVID vaccines, and if you want them free of charge, you come up to the pharmacy, they'll give it. I'm like, absolutely not. And I'm like, you know what? This make a great shit post shit. for my new public Instagram. Moonlit Alter, Instagram, public. Get out of it. It's one word. Get on That's gonna get banned in like fucking a week. Uh probably because <laughs> Biden's handed out Edward <laughs> passes if you get vaccinated. Oh yeah, that's right. That's <sighs> fucking fantastic. There, right? If so, only we had that a week ago. <laughs> that's I mean, so I made I made the joke. I was like, yeah, they're handing out free vaccines, and since I care about my kid, I'm not giving it to either of us. I want to live. Well, yeah, no. Yeah, man. I was actually. Oh yeah, go I was ahead. actually in an in an Uber uh, yesterday because I went with um. My stepsister and a bunch of her like girlfriends and stuff, and like one other dude who's a fucking dope. That's beside the point. After we went to the bar, not wearing a mask because no one was wearing one, uh, we left and we had to wear one in the Ubers because they still follow that rule. Whatever. So we're wearing it in there, and um, he he was he was straight up talking like the this dude was like, I couldn't really pin down the accent. It was like some type of like French, like. African kind of accent, like actual African. French I should point that out. I couldn't tell you if he had a French accent, but it also still sound like Kenyan Nigerian, some along those lines. Again, I'm not very well versed over, about over there, so I'm probably wrong. Just, just naming random African countries until just I'm just countries I know exist um, in Africa. <laughs> or, but we're we're in the car, and he's like, and several of them are like talking about the vaccine. Like, oh, I, I'm a I'm a like. Pfizer girl, I'm I'm just like okay, this part's really fucking cringe. I'm a and then the guy driving guy. is like, and the, and the guy driving is like, um, yeah, I didn't get that. Uh, and one of the girls is like, why? Why didn't you get it? It's like I'm gonna wait wait at least a year and see what happens to the rest of you guys. You might all just die or something. <laughs> I'll wait a year. Yeah. And I was like, my man, all right, that's yeah. a pretty reasonable stance. I'm gonna wait a yeah. year, okay. See if anything bad happens in the next year. Okay, that is a reasonable one. These these stands to have like. I'll, like that I'm is. Gonna, I'm on Anifax. I'm just gonna wait for to, like to see what you happens to you guys, and then I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go do it. Listen, if you not. guys just start to melt in six months, then I'll just know not to get the vaccine. So, I, to be fair, I was planning to like at some point get like really like work out, eat really well, all this kind of stuff. Save some of my spam, so I have like 
viable option if anything ever goes wrong in the next five or so years. And it's like, I'd have to want to do that probably before I got like ate that kind of shit injected in me just to play extra safe. I'd just get a fake vaccine card. <laughs> yeah, right. Or just. Yeah, that's the thing. I, have to, I'm, I plan on going like international, like um, to Portugal, like in September. And like, definitely, probably, they probably want you to have like a vaccine card or something like that. And. Use fake. Ugh. Don't do it, Yimmy. I like. I don't think I will. I mean, to, you're gonna start to melt in three months like a Chernobyl firefighter. Don't do it. Oh God! Someone tried Jesus Christ to say like they thought it was like a good post and people like were blogging it. I don't remember if it was on like, Twitter or Tumblr. Would well, they be retweeting? Okay. I don't. I don't know, dude. Everything blends Tumblr. together. I've been working a lot. Like business is picking back up at my job, by the way. So mm-hmm. my shit posts Word. are probably gonna dwindle based away. Red pill. Very based red pill. Bullshit. Mm-hmm. You should so, start charging a higher premium so you can make more shit posts. Yeah. It's like right, but like, guys, like this whole year I had like I had plenty of time to shit post and now I have to work, like actually work again. It's like so hard. Okay. It's like ah it's like I mean like I'm I'm sitting on the computer just watching shit on Hulu and HBO Max at work. Like there's nothing to do. <sighs> Maybe now the I communists think... are right, fuck. Yeah, just communists are right. So anyways, where the fuck was I going? So the post in question was so long long, it's like, oh yeah, if your doctor's like, well, you we don't have a record of your shot. Like, oh, I got it at one of those pop up vaccination sites. Like, oh, okay, we'll just add it. To, we'll just add it to your um, records. Like, that's how you get around it. Like, no, that's not how you get around it because they're gonna want to verify it with the wherever medical whatever medical place you went to for that shot is gonna have a record of it. So they're gonna want that sent over. They're not gonna take your fucking word for it, dumbass. What you do is you don't tell anybody. You write it on a fake card. And then you fucking present it to them, like, from your doctor to somebody else. Because they're not going to fucking know. Because of HIPAA, right? HIPAA. 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 That was the other funny thing. I like that fact check they did. Like, oh, it's actually not against HIPAA to ask if you're vaccinated. Like, that sh- that's not what people are saying when it's a HIPAA violation. Like, they can't pull your records. And you you can't actually you like you don't have to provide them physical records of your medical shit dumbass because yeah you, you can go have... to certain countries unless you have certain vaccinations like you can't go to like certain countries unless you have like some for malaria like they're gonna have to check for certain things if you go to certain places yeah and you're gonna have you're at, you're like literally gonna have to disclose your information for that mm-hmm. which is what another thing well that's well that's the other that's the other thing too like People make people make that like that argument, right? Like, well, you have to get vaccinations, go to public school, or uh, to other countries. So, like, what's the big deal with the COVID vaccination? Um, because it hasn't had the twelve years that the FDA usually does, right? Yeah. Oh, it's not even FDA approved. Yeah, it's all, it's it, it, not even a year. They they went like straight to animal, to, like not they went straight to human testing to get this done. So you don't know shit about it. It's like released under an emergency powers clause. It's the only reason it can be distributed. Yeah, just emergency authorization. Like, it's not... It's not actually... Just with the National Guard handing them out, too. It's all Dude, the pamphlet... I I wish I had that up. My grandma, she got the vaccine. Look, she got COVID and got over it. Like, no problem. She's like, yeah, I like a little cough. I'm like, you're 95. (laughs) Jesus. I'm like, good for you. She's like, yeah, sorry about all you, sorry about you, are you other geriatric fucks, but I'm different. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, they're like, yeah, but like the little pamphlet she gets is like, yeah, this is not an approved vaccine and there could be side effects and shit. And then she took it. I was like, you're afraid of death. Why would you do that? And she's like, well, I'll go figure, like, why not? Right. I'm like, you're crazy, but I respect <laughs> you. She got the super soldier serum. She's fine. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Dude, she's a fucking beast. I remember there was, uh, she used to, do, you know what it was? Laps at the Y, the the Y. She used to swim in the pool, do laps in the Y. She was tough as shit. Because there was one day, granted, I think it was like eighteen at the time, so uh, a lifetime ago, is that she was she she came over to my parents' house and she was reaching in her back back seat of the car, like she got out of the car, opened the back door, and was leaning in to get something. Some van came by and clipped the door, so it whipped and snapped back on her legs. And she walked Ooh. into the house, like, did, like, did, like, help and whatever. And my brother freaked out. This is the cop, by the way. My brother, <laughs> brother freaks out. <laughs> and my mom's like, "Call nine one one right now." And he's like, "What's the number?" Like, legitimately, asked what the number for nine one one is. I'm like, "You What's dumb, the, oh. you dumbass." 
and how he's protecting. That's a question people. you can only ask when you're Quote, stoned unquote. a farm. Yeah, he's protecting. Now he's protecting and serving. Yeah. God bless America. I guess. Huh? Yeah, good, good for him. I'm about to like wipe that. <laughs> oh no, this is the part, right? So like, yeah, here's the city he's working at. Go get him. Go get him. <laughs> hmm. Do you still have the power stash shift. though? That's a real question. No, that was only temporary. Oh, forget about it. I don't care anymore. Yeah, no, so my grandma's uh, good at that. But yeah, the vaccine's not even oh. fucking... It's not even... Like, they don't know shit. What was an interesting thing I learned was that they've been... For years, they've been... I think since, since the last SARS whatever virus, mm. like, the la- like the last COVID whatever mm. thing happened, uh, they've been trying to work on a vaccine for it. And in all the animals, what they were doing is they, like, they, they, for the past decade, they've been trying to work on something. And they would inject it in animals. It seemed good. Like, okay, cool, we got antibodies. And then they would inject the actual, like, the coronavirus, not the current coronavirus, but the coronavirus into these animals. And it would mm-hmm. fucking, like, hyper, like, I don't know if it's, like, the cytokine storm or something like that, whatever the fuck it's pronounced. Well, like, the immune yeah. response was, like, too aggressive? Yeah, like, it, it, the antibodies were helping the fucking virus attack and, like, some weird reaction to where it wouldn't have been mm-hmm. as bad without the vaccine they were they were given. So Shit. that's why we haven't had a coronavirus fucking vaccine. And now, like, since we don't know, like, all these people that have gotten the vaccine, like, oh, yeah, I'm good, and, like, and haven't gotten again. Like, I don't, I'm not saying that any, everyone's going to have this terrible reaction to it, but you might see the, the people that are dying, this might be happening. What is it, like 3,000 right now? 3,000 people more? That have died from the vaccine, right? Well, not or of that we it know. wasn't. It wasn't from the vaccine. It was something completely unrelated. Of course. Which who cares? If it was twenty four hours after the vaccine. They could have done you know, something else, and you know, yeah. stroked heart, out. Heart in, in my case, it's been like, well, uh, fair enough. <laughs> yeah. Heart inflammation is perfectly normal in a twenty four year old. That happens all the time. Yeah. The so. question was, did he do steroids? <laughs> oh yeah, he's doing doing some roids. Do some Diana Ball. So that's that's the weird shit. So like I hate so yeah, every, I, anyone ones. listening to this, if you make comparison like well you're trying to make the argument that vaccines are good and that everyone should get this COVID one, go fucking shut your mouth and stop making the comparison because you're wrong because this has not been tested like all these other ones. That's that's the argument we all need to be making is just what the government standard is, you know? <laughs> Of course, they'll just point out that there's an emergency declaration. Yeah, I know that. No, that's what with, like, this whole time, just like I've been, you know, just mentioning the CD, like linking the CDC and shit and like mainstream, like left wing news or whatever. Like, yeah, here we go. You know, what you say? Well, you guys aren't following the science. Like, this is the science. Follow it. Right? It's that simple. That's how it was supposed to be that simple for anybody else who's like an anti masker, right? Just it's that simple. Follow the science and you're not doing it. Like everyone, Fauci finally said that, yeah, if you're vaccinated, you don't need to wear a mask. And like, well, I'm going to, I don't trust anybody else because I could, I, I, I can get somebody else to wear a mask. Like the mask doesn't protect you. It was supposed to protect others, right? And if you're not wearing a mask, you can't spread it because of the vaccine. Is that not how it works? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I can't keep up. I can't keep up with these people. And they, clearly they can't keep you up. You just either. gotta listen and believe. So, don't but I don't, dude, I don't, I'm just gonna, we're gonna wrap up the serious portion. Because we went, like, ten minutes too long on it. Yeah, I, I stopped but listening just, at a certain point. Basically, uh, of course. <laughs> if, if you were an anti-masker like us, you're based in Red Pill, and you fucking won. You won we the won. game. It only we took won. it only took four hundred and fifteen days, but we got here and we're good. Let's give it another five days and we'll call it four hundred and twenty. Ooh, yo, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna smoke that old weed in my wife's pipe. Oh, Ooh, oh yeah, God. yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna do Fucking that 420 special. Fucking ass. I don't want to do it while wearing a mask. <laughs> oh yeah, wear my bane mask and blow it through. Look at that. Shit's broken. Hair stays on with the hat, the natural wave. How you doing? All right, so on a more serious uh, commentary, you remember when you coming down here to get topped, bro? 
Uh, probably next week, actually. Next week, okay, based. I'm yeah, next week. Wife. I'm gonna I'm gonna visit my mom, Jersey. For those of you watching, we will be having a special pay per view link for mm-hmm. this event. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna visit already, his house. Already got, already got the I don't, I don't know. I'm gonna have. I got the white towel. That's the one. I'm gonna. I'm gonna the, wipe the question is, will I have the balls to actually talk to your wife in, in the sense of saying, like, "Hey, I'm here to like get my shit rocked by your husband." <laughs> Ben's just died over the towel thing. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you ever what? How's how's gonna go down? Matt, how funny. much thought have you put into this? <laughs> I didn't. I forgot. I I forgot to finish folding that last night because I was drinking. I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna play video games. So that's been sitting there since last night. <laughs> I'm gonna grow man with kids to do. Just right now. Well, dude, I, I was out. I was outside all fucking day. I'm kidding. Day I'm kidding. It's all right. That. It's I was okay. All, I, was out, I was outside all day doing that. And it's okay, like, man. I'm, I'm joking. It's all right. You don't have to. I'm gonna it. fuck it's it. Okay. No, it was, it was the joke. The joke. I'm thinking. Of, I was like, I, was, I think I was at work Friday. I'm like, you know, what fucking hilarious would be if Yipper just showed up and I got to explain to my wife. I'm like, well, he, I've got to top him now. Like, <laughs> I thought <laughs> I actually like, I, here. like I like you're gonna be at joke. work because I don't know your work hours, and she's gonna call like, there's. Some fucking like wop out here. He's playing like the loudest music I've ever heard in a car before. And he says something about like you blowing his back out. I I don't. Did you did you order a male like stripper? Like what what is this? Is this like a joke or something? He's like no no. I have oh, to damn. fuck him. You understand? Feed him <laughs> your mac and cheese, and I'm gonna fuck him. Terrible. Generous. It's not degeneracy if it's if it's love. Yeah, it's true. That's what <laughs> funny. The wife's like, okay, fine. I mean, if he drove all this way, like, yeah, right, okay. I'll <laughs> get the camera. Ugh, fine. I mean, I guess. No, that wouldn't. That wouldn't really go down like that. But I was. I no, it'd go down like who? Who the fuck are you? I was like, no, well, let, let me, let me explain. <laughs> Friends on His wife goes and gets the gun. That's what happens. <laughs> You're like, let me explain. <laughs> This is going to make a great podcast episode. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, it's going to be a great story for me. Do it, just for, the, me. Do it for the podcast, honey. Support mm-hmm. my dreams. I supported yours. I gave you children. <laughs> and he's going to give me his children. How you doing? It's like, <laughs> hey, yeah. Hey, wife, do you remember that time I told you that if you ever cheated on me, that I would fuck a guy in front of you? Well, this is just a preemptive strike. The Emeralds, <laughs> get those pants off. I'm just kidding. <laughs> get those pants off. Take your pants off and jack it. God, this beer is so good. I love Miller Lite. Not a sponsor of the show, by the way. <laughs> oh. Oh, so what do you... Shit, what have you guys been up to this weekend? Not much. Oh, God. Worked yesterday. Oh, what's the uh, what's the mass shit like at uh, wherever the jewelry shit you're at right now? So right now, customers, we have a sign that says if you have a vaccine, you don't have to wear a mask. And I literally tell customers like, yeah, if you identify as vaccinated, you don't have to wear a mask. And they're like, Based. oh, OK. And yeah, but we as employees still have to fucking wear a mask. But I just I have, I have that shit pulled below my nose. I don't give a fuck anymore. Nobody cares. If you I always had it hanging on the side like here. Like a little little earring kind of type beat, so mm-hmm. I just didn't have this thing under my nose because this nose is just pull it to the side like Dracula. Prominent. If you're literally, literally, it's just it's just here, and then I'll put it on like this, and I'll be like, "Would you like to finance this Kia?" Oh, oh. What if you like if you were like quote unquote vaccinated? Could you take the mask off? Even if you're vaccinated, you can't take the mask off. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but do you want to buy a Hyundai Palisade or not, bro? No, I want to buy <laughs> no, a fucking Honda. Not. Hyundai, Honda, they're pretty close. The same shit. Asian. Is, isn't one like Korean? Yes. Hun- Hyundai, Hyundai Motor Group is all Korean, so okay, Hyundai so Kia Genesis is all Korean. Oh, funny shit. They're good cars. They're getting better. My wife's car, she's got a Rogue. That's the one, I, well, it's my car now, I drive that. She, she mm-hmm. drives oh, a Nissan? A Nissan? <laughs> I was, I was thinking about it, it like Nissan. A Nissan? A Nissan? Because her dad insured the car until, like, you know, she got here and got, like, with me, and, like, we just transferred everything over. And, like, that's when we found out. For years, they had the wrong VIN number. They had a VIN yeah. number for a completely different Nissan. That's great. And he was like, well, what would have happened if we got oh in an accident? God. I'm like, well, 
you would have been fucked because they'd be like, well, we'll pay for damages, but you have to produce the car with this VIN number. So, like, anything, then, if yeah. anything ever happened to that car, they would have been fucked. Like, all that, all that premium, all the premiums they're paying, right out the window. Oh, so, I'm like, premium's I'm like, well, gone. luckily, oh, you're good. Oh, didn't your premiums for your uh, truck go wa- way down when you moved out there? Or they go up? Dude, it went from like, I went from paying like 120 a month to like $75 a month. Oh, that's very nice. That, it's that's wild. Nice. New York drivers are apparently that terrible. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Are. A lot of them, a lot of terrible drivers. Mm-hmm. That's why all, all the, all the it's body because it's guys a bunch of area. women and minorities. That's why. Well, let's talk about um. <laughs> let's talk about our. <laughs> let's sit down on that one. I'm not gonna say anything. I just cruise uh, cruising the uh the Tumblr, uh notifications here or not look again. Let's talk about our favorite person, uh Uncle Beanbag. Front of the show, not re- no, never will be a front of the show. I fucking hate every comment that guy makes. I'm putting it out. He there. says nice things to me every once in a while. I, that's always what happens. I, I'll like not like somebody for a while, and they'd be like nice to me, and I'm like, I can't be a complete dick, right? I I'm, I just I'm too passive. With I am people. the nicest person there is, but I've got uh... fucking. I'm, <laughs> I'm dude. I'm I'm actually really nice until I get annoyed by somebody, and then it's like you have to like pay me to like you again. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because no, like every fucking comment this dude makes, like like any post I have, I'm just like, why? It's unnecessary. Like I made the joke, uh, I think I think I posted like the the, the joke meme with Car, like it was Karl Marx saying, um, the, the you have the right to you have the right to firearms, right? The actual of Karl Marx shit. I'm like, wow, I'm like Karl Marx is actually pretty base or something. He's like, this guy's oh, no. still bad. Okay, like even though he said something that's agreeable, he's still bad. I'm like. Are you fucking? Are you? F- I'm like I actually. I'm like, are you fucking retarded? He's like, like and, and he's like trying to play, like you know, trying to play like you know, like funsies for his like fucking followers and shit. I like, I'm like you were. Fu- I'm like you were so fucking stupid. Like you're gonna pick. Like you're gonna obviously Karl Marx is stupid as shit and bad. Duh, motherfucker. Like I'm a Captain Hindsight. You didn't even have like the best facial hair of the communists. Like he had the worst yeah. one, arguably next to Mao Zedong. He didn't have like, any facial hair. That tough set the side like this. Like this, but no hair on top. Yeah, fucking Captain Hindsight with uh, who who you know what? Let me just do a poll. Like who? What communist uh leader or state communist leader had the best hairstyle? Joseph Stalin. Stalin oh. easily had like he had my flow when he was younger. Then he got the power stash. Short king. Stars Stalin had go. fucking drip. Like there's no yeah no. Like, Ignoring the mass he, genocide, he, he, he you know he invented the drip. He Great invented hair. Drip. For sure. He, he invented drip when he... And by drip, um, we mean the dripping blood of the Ukrainians that he slaughtered. Did he kill any Jews? Of course. Oh, base, base. Who didn't base. kill Jews? Wait, 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 wait. Name a country mm. or an empire that didn't kill Jews. I forgot. I told you we were going to talk about anything uh, Jewish related, so we're going we're to revert, revert. <laughs> or not talking about anything yeah. Jewish related. Try not to. He's like, they have the whole uh, uh, Israeli-Palestine thing. But when oh. we talked about enough. I'll give it a little break. Well, once we talk about subject matter, it is so out of my head at that point where I'm just like, not that I even say that much. I don't add enough to any of these conversations. It's just out of my head at a certain point. I'm like, all right, I'm done with that conversation. I really have to deal with it in my personal life because people are like, oh, you have a political podcast. You can use your political opinions. Like, you don't want them. I'm telling you right now, you don't want them. Yeah. <laughs> You're like going to get be. upset. I'm going to get like upset. That it's, it's also like how I explained um, to... Uh, Friend of the show, uh, Ultimatum, uh, my boy, um, the Finnish King. Where I was explaining the, it before, the, is like, did he finish? On the you Finnish King. Finish him? We both finished the same time. We just connected nice. that way. Um, where I was explaining to him was like, it's like you, you, you probably, you probably get like blocked automatically because people just think you're awful and you don't tell people that you're joking or anything. I was like, well, yeah, like in real life, I'm like an actual human being, but I'm telling him like. The outward appearance is I'm awful. The inward appearance is I'm nice. I just keep it that way because, like, it's not worth it. It's not worth it on that site to, like, be the most upstanding person. But sometimes, like, all right, all right, you got to relax sometimes, bro. You got to relax a little bit. Like, you're a little fucking weird. You're a little fucking crazy, dude. Like, what's good with you? Then you, you see people like Cybersmith. You're like, okay. What? Then you look at, like, a blog like Cybersmith and you're like, could be worse. I could be worse. I could be astronomically worse on this site 
Then I see half the people get banned like every week. I'm like, I could easily be like way worse. Mainly because, hey, some of them are kind of funny. But other times it's just like, all right, all right, these jokes are running thin, man. Be- being an awful human being is only funny for as funny as you can yeah. be. And you're running out of it, man. See, I like the it's humor. like it's like too. It's like people are like, some someone messaged me and they're like, you should you should watch out for the Unicron. He's a, a transphobe. I'm like, who's a transphobe? <laughs> Supposedly me. I don't I don't You're know where that. I mean, biggest transphobe what? on the planet. Didn't you date a trans person? That, that, yeah. Yeah, so how the fuck are you because tra- you, you stopped dating because you're transphobic. I dated them specifically just to break their heart. I, I think I think it's mostly because every once in a while there's one thing where it's like, hey, there's some so there's some negatives in the community, either trans trans community, the gay community, the LGBT as a whole. And you know, yet again, I'm not a fan when things are bad in a community that I'm part of. Technically, I should really say technically, I'm definitely in it. I went to fucking Stonewall, which honestly, Stonewall, a little bit overrated as a place, but it was nice to be there. It was cool. It was cool to be there, but it's, it's overrated. It's just such a small little place. It's got cool history. That's really about it. I feel like I, it I was better when the mob place. was still in there. That's a very, you know, I'll, I will bring that up actually. We never actually started talking about like the mob's influences um, as a discussion for this show, but I'll quickly go mm-hmm. over them about Stonewall. And I, I mean, I, I knew more I about it. I literally told you. Movie months ago that we could do yeah. a mob episode you just got to come up with it I, yeah ago. i totally forgot that you, you i forgot completely that you told me i could do that because you just, fucking you drink and pound already. twinks <laughs> that's, that's your problem <laughs> that that being said i will i will now quickly discuss the mob owning stonewall right, let's go. so basically i want to say it was the 60s and the mob being the mob, pretty much ran just about everything in the city that was major to an extent, one way or another. Be it construction, be it any type of union job. The, they paid off the police, they paid off politicians. I mean, hell, they got JFK in office. All that kind of stuff. Until and Giuliani came him. in and kind of fucked them up. I feel like, which, yeah, honestly, that's, I mean, considering who shot Lee Javier Oswald afterwards, it kind of suggests a little the bit Jews to their killed way. JFK. Kind of I actually miss who we're I mean, there about. was a Jewish mob that worked with the Italian mob, so I mean, that's not necessarily wrong. Oh no! Didn't you hear that? I, like, that's a conspiracy. Th- well, that's like one of the theories, I guess, is that. Um, I I wouldn't believe it was just like the cabal of Jewish people that we're, exists. We're going to bring it back like to the Israeli Palestine thing because I don't care anymore. <laughs> oh god damn it! No, no, just so oh, I, heard, I heard some I, cons- I heard some theory that it was because uh, JFK was anti-Zionist or something. <laughs> that that's why he got killed. It's real fucking sad. The Mossad or whatever fucking killed him. I was like, "Are you crazy?" Right now? Whatever. Continue. Mossad during that <laughs> era, which which was hunting down like Nazis in Argentina and had like no security. To just yeah, get just, I believe well, this now. Decently well. <laughs> I oh, was a German guy who visited who came here uh, ten <laughs> the, years the, after World War Two. This is me. The sources. Of <laughs> so, all right, go with the mob, baby. Keep to you. Okay, Matt's like but, this was revealed based... to me in a dream. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, during like the '60s and going on, the the mob had like their hands on a lot of businesses. You kind of call it the golden age until like the '80s, pretty much. And mm-hmm. basically, they, they at one point realized they had their hand. They had their hands in a lot of pies. A lot of pies. Tasted of garlic for a while. Just, just um, elbow deep in a lot of pies, just right up. Just, yeah. Mm. But at a certain certain point, they realize, well, there's a lot of these gay bars coming up, and they they get like smashed up by the cops. They get harassed, all sort of kind of stuff. But they bring in a lot of money because it's a group of clientele that very much go to a certain specific place. So these mob guys are like, okay, so we'll give them protection. And we'll pretty much make sure the bars keep on running and we can get a good chunk of money from this community, as well as we'll wiretap the bathrooms and pretty much anywhere they possibly could to get dirt on politicians or any significant person who may get in their way in the future, which is a very big thing they did, which is why I usually bring up that bribing people, it could work, but someone could always just take the money and didn't immediately go to somebody of authority. Blackmailing somebody always works because... That's something you can hang over anybody's head, something they don't want out, especially if you're a politician, especially in that time period, because being gay, ooh, ooh, not great. So, Yimra, hypothetical question. In that scenario, okay. in that kind of relationship between the mob and the gay bars, would you say that the mob was topping the gay bars? Yes. Oh, yes, 100%. just yes. I, I knew it was not going to be an actual question. The answer is yes. Excellent. 
Excellent. Maybe they're a power bomb because of the money they didn't make. I don't know. Mm. Look, here, here's another question. It's super serious. Um, ben, yes. looking mad cute. So what I'm, what I'm, what I'm saying is Yimra, would you let Ben top mm-hmm. you? If you got to forget that he's Jewish, but would you let him top you in that outfit? In the outfit, he's wearing the outfit I'm wearing. Why would we care about your outfit? You're a bottom in this scenario. Do you like, know if yeah, I wear matter. wonderful outfits? Excuse you, sir. Uh, too much blue. I'm not a big fan of the color okay. of blue. You um, like my wife? She's casual like setting. So uh, change your shirt. Think I'll think about it after that. Maybe the power wow. suit. I'll think with the power suit. I might allow it. I need you suit. to scream expensive, not not um, Judaic lumberjack. As powerful that as that is on its own. Women fear the Judaic lumberjack. <laughs> Women fear it. Men don't though. Yeah, men don't. Mm-mm. I just get it. It's so. sought after. Be fair. There's not. There's not many. There's not as many attractive like Jewish guys as Jewish girls, at least in my my general areas. I found it's it's like it's, it's like a coin inbreed. toss. Well, there are certain like. You want to be like anti-Semitic for the last like twenty minutes, minutes, or what's up? Like, what do you guys? <laughs> I mean, if you guys want, I I open the salvo, so you guys have your K-word passes. Those oh, are distributed based. early. Well, I like to uh, need it. Oh, the, the need it, and not use it, or whatever the fucking you you know the phrase. You know what it is. I'm going Joe Biden. No, I was like, what's up? Uh, yeah, drive the drivers that drive and they drive. Yeah. Exactly. I'd rather have the the pass and not have to use it instead of having to use it without the pass. Whatever. Whatever Okay. Yes. No, that works. Yeah. I'm tired. It's been a a long weekend. A long weekend. Yeah. Like the whole slide thing out back, like because we like that tube slide and shit. Well, I was like, oh, how long do you think it's gonna take you to do? I'm like, I don't know, like maybe two hours. And I'm getting into it. I'm like, the whole fucking frame of this thing, like the original structure is like inches off level like it's fucking suede like it, I'm, and I, like I'm sitting i'm standing back looking at it like yeah god damn what the fuck because i put a level on it first i'm like because if nothing was matching up when i went to go put pieces in and i'm like holy shit this thing's like i was like for like because the slope's bad anyway like the, like the ground's going down a couple like like it's i think it's every every foot it drops two inches that's the slope Oof. um but that's just the ground, like, whatever, no big deal. But the fucking structure, it's, like, over, it's, like, a half inch off over a foot, right? So it's, like, leaning one way, like, or half inch, quarter inch or something. So it's, like, it's not terrible, but, like, if you're trying to make, like, accurate, because I'm fucking accurate, like, I'm, like, all right, we're down to the fucking, it's gotta be good, I got my square. I got then you should have poured a concrete pad. I didn't build it. I Wait, Matt, we're there. live, right? Yeah, we're live. Why? Oh, is there like any comments? No, there's people, black out the there's, screen. There is a wait. What? I thought it was like comments. It's live, right? So it'd be comments. Yeah, no. There's uh, there are. We are live. It says, I think there's five viewers, but no one's commenting. So maybe we're in the background. Unless well, you, someone, you someone's just... using this to get someone's getting having sex. They're like, I need some background noise. Mm-hmm. Let me put my mm-hmm. third favorite podcast on and uh, just just blow her back out or his back out or their back out i don't know it's 2020 oh did you guys One. did you guys post a link nope i, s- I forget every <laughs> second I, time i forgot dude, I, literally, I, I literally said oh, oh, I, I think it's like a bad time too because it's sunday at fucking like 8 30 because i post a link and no one's even fucking seen it which it was like any like a prime time i'd get like at least 30 like instantly <sighs> right but mm-hmm. um, it's all right. Oh no, no, no one cares. Everyone, like, everyone just listens to it because they, it's it's easier to watch it after it's done and edited beautifully. With that sweet vaporwave intro that I found for free and chopped it together. <laughs> That's how it goes. Mm-hmm. So, uh, no, no big deal. No, it's like yeah, but no, we're like I'm looking back. I'm like, did the fucking screen go black? Are we done? So. Uh, I really hope the audio didn't quit. <laughs> to watch feel like people are listening to just us moving. Nothing's happening. 
but I'll find out later. That's okay. So anyways. I do um, still have a backup, so. Wait, why do you guys both oh. have gamer chairs? Uh, because, because I'm a fucking gamer. gamer. What the fuck kind of question is that? Oh, speaking of <laughs> speaking of fucking gaming, dude, learn how to fucking play Village, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> I only died three times that entire game, bro. Don't even. No. When I came in, you would just die to that fucking helicopter enemy shooting flames. Like, oh, yeah. That was that? like one of the three times I died. Because I, mm-hmm. I yeah. never upgraded my, my movement speed because I could never find all you the food items be together. I was lazy. If you didn't die. That is true. If you got good. I, I died twice in a row. And I saw like three and people leave. I'm, yeah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just fucking with you. Dude, I I'm died, not like, kidding. You need to get good. I would have died so many times. Like, unreal. Well, it's that, like, that stream actually went way more well than I thought it would. Because for each video, they, they all got like at least 30 views. One had like 30, one had 40, one had like 50. Popping. I was like, oh, this is actually not bad. Your, your live chat was popping. It was going. It was, it was going pretty good. I, I, I don't want to like make it a completely regular thing because like there's a certain point where they get kind of exhausting, especially when I drink. I actually like get and to a point where I just don't talk. I fucking there test out. Oh, oh, God. Yeah. Black and yellow, black and yellow. Wait, what brand is that racing chair? Oh, it's like that racing chair. GT it's not Omega. Ricardo, is it? Oh, fuck. GT Omega. Dude, it was cheap. It was like the cheapest chair you can get. Well, almost the cheapest. I just have one. an office chair that has like a missing, like fucking bolt at the bottom. Well, that my, I have to like my fix thing was every once is, in a while. Like all of these super fucking things. It's it's the like the office like the super comfort office chairs are like two hundred and fifty bucks and the gamer chair is like two hundred and fifty mm-hmm. bucks. So it's like, well, if I'm going to pay the same amount of money, I might as well get anarcho capitalist colors. Mm-hmm. And that's what I did. You could have sprayed it you could have sprayed it yellow. Are you fucking retarded? I got kids. <laughs> They're gonna get the fumes in there if I just spray paint it. It's right? good for you the kids in the high, paint. you know? You start them off early. Dude, this chair's dope because I can go straight back. Oh, hell yeah. Oh. I can do the same what? thing about breaking this Yo, chair exactly. on the spot like, trying to do that. Maybe. Is as far as it goes, actually, I think. Probably something it goes all the way back. Yeah. You can nap. Because I remember I was watching a boring movie. Uh, I think it was Ghost Protocol uh, with Tom Cruise because he's gay. Uh, Fucking Scientologist piece of shit. What? <laughs> like, hey. I think I was I was so fucking tired. I think it was actually when I was doing like the housework and I was taking a break. Like I I, I sat down to eat dinner and watch something just for like ten minutes. And I'm like, oh my god, I'm so tired. You know, I'm like, I'm just gonna kick this thing back, even though I have a fucking couch back behind me. It was in this room. I'm like, yeah. Instead of moving, that's how tired I was. Instead of just fucking moving to the couch, I'm like, I'm just gonna kick this thing back and take and close my eyes for about ten minutes. Well, an hour and a half later. <laughs> I was feeling pretty good. Feeling pretty good. <laughs> yeah, like I'm trying to keep my voice down, which is not like incredibly creepy as the time progresses. Like I'm gonna be a Resident Evil Village villain, Yimra. I'm oh, coming yeah. for that ham cheek. What is a ham cheek? You promise? You're gonna find out. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm looking for that. I really need that. <laughs> it's like... Uh, we're gonna become an ASMR channel where it's just uh, sexually harassing each other. I like, yeah, yeah, you like that? Go on and get it. Yeah, you if like that? Go on and if, get it. If we're gonna be an ASMR channel, I like Ben's just shaking his head. He's like, please no, for the love of God. If we're gonna do that. You might, you need to get a new mic. You need an actual mic. I need like an actual like professional one. Yeah, you need to get like not a, dude. Like my, mine was like. Wait, wait, put it close to the mic. Keep going. Keep going, Ben. No, put, Go. do it again. Do it again. I need, I need that brain like ejaculation that happens. Yeah, that's the one I don't get. I've been seeing a lot more of these people eating ASMRs. The, the, um, the like, uh, I, I'm gonna, I almost said like a totally different word, but whatever it's called, um, the mukbang, where it's just like, either like really attract, well, I should say really attractive, moderately attractive women. Eating like a shit ton of food, or you have like that big fat gay guy who who like has a mental breakdown every episode. It's like I just sit there and it's like I don't, I don't think I reco- I don't have the kind of mental illness for this. Like I have other ones that work for me, but this this is the mental yeah. illness I don't have to watch this shit. I don't get it. I don't. I don't want to say I don't get it because there's probably a good reason. I don't know. I don't care. But it's so weird because you 
you're watching someone who's like easily like a buck twenty in weight, eating like a desk worth of food, and you're like, there's no way they're doing this healthily because you don't eat that kind of food. You're not gonna burn the calories for that. Now that build, now that body type. Unless unless yeah. you're the, the 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 big fat gay guy who my, cries every episode my big because fat gay wedding. mentally ill or whatever. My my big fat Greek gay wedding. We're both hairy and handsome. We you each don't have to say Greek gay. That's redundant. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, there's no way you, they don't have like an eating disorder of some kind. That's the part that makes you like really upset. Like, like. I guess the money's worth it for them, but it really probably isn't. Like, you can't be, you can't have that kind of body and eat that kind of shit at like 32. And then you have like lipstick and it doesn't very like get on any of the food you're having. Very specific number you just I'm, I, I like getting a specific number. I like to get an image in people's heads. It's like, I'm 32. Why are you saying it, huh? Look what are you doing? Just I don't know, man. Maybe I want to watch you. saying he wants you to slim up a little bit before he bottoms Are you saying you're, here you're, a, you're a feeder? Is that what you do? <laughs> Everyone knows what a feeder is, right? Yimra is the architect. <laughs> no, you're, you're, no, you've heard that shit. But like, there's like, there's like, uh, women and like, well, dudes, women, oh. or whatever. They like to feed people. Oh no, I know, I know of, of what that is. I am, until they die, I'm well versed in all the things I don't want to do sexually. I, I think I, have I brought this up before? Where like during during a sexual encounter, I don't want to think about food. I don't want to eat food. The second I eat food. Out the window, the concept of sex. If someone talks about food while I'm, while I'm doing it, I'm like, nah, we're done. With the exception of whipping <laughs> I like the expressions. I like your very tally with it. Like, yo, like, no, 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 we're, nah, we're, we're done. I'm out of I know. I'm I, it's, just, it's just one of those things where it's like, someone's telling me, like, yeah, sometimes you put like a donut around my dick. I'm like, no. I'm not, I'm not the doing that. It's pro- like, I'm, no. it's not going to fit anyways. It's, my mind's too small. It's not going to fit anyways. What? Yeah. You can do like a little <laughs> helicopter, go fly it, fly it out. I like, um, I'm just, I'm just thinking about the podcast. Like, I'm waiting for someone to go, wow, like out of nowhere. Like, guys, your your podcast is really going downhill. Like, you're just really drilling. You're not like, even talking about anything political anymore. I'm like, why it's going downhill is no one gives us comments. No one's telling us what we're doing right. No one's telling us what we're doing wrong. So guess what? We're just going to fucking what? keep doing what we're doing. Being racist, right? Oh wait, no, I can't be racist till June first. We get that vaccine. Yeah, no, I, I play the fake COVID card, so I can say the right. word. Oh, we're sprashing back around to Uncle Beanbag, like <laughs> fucking bastard. <laughs> hey, um, he. So the the mock up. Does he watch these? No, he doesn't. He doesn't follow me. Hell no. And I hope you know what if he does if he does watch these or listen to these, he can go fuck himself. That's like dead ass. Well, thank you for the support. <laughs> yeah. No, what support? Fuck him. Oh, he's not doing shit. It's Dude, another I'm, viewer number. I don't know. What to I don't tell care. You. I don't care. I don't care if he was if his soul reblogs got a thousand fucking hits or something or two thousand. Right? He can go fuck himself. I, I stupid. I don't think I'd want that many people watching because I think it would just it would just get bad. I don't so quick. care. Well, that's another Welcome. interesting uh, thing to cross. Is like, what if, what if we do have, you know, thousands of people? Then I'm out of a fucking job, boy. <laughs> no. Yeah, no, we're gonna start us. charging for listening. advertising at that point. Yeah, right. yeah, no, it's just to keep, it's just to keep, just to keep me from from dying alone yeah, in, a, yeah, in a, like a like a warehouse in Kentucky. So the fake post was President Biden. I'm just gonna sort of finish this off real quick. President Biden going, all fully vaccinated people will have the N-word pass starting January 1st. And I'm like, they finally convinced me to get the gene therapy. And then Uncle Fat Ass said, oh, I, nice. I, I, I don't need presidential permission. <laughs> he said he doesn't need presidential permission on the, on the shit post. I hate this guy because he, he LARPs that he... No, but the thing is, he didn't even say it in the post. He was he he literally if he wanted to make it a good joke he would have said I don't need presidential permission n word right but he didn't mm. so so I want to I want to hit him back with like but you didn't even say the word so apparently you do right and then I want him to, <laughs> then I want to come back and say the word so that I can report him <laughs> and get him deleted <laughs> oh, whoa whoa wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute you're gonna go to an authority. 
It's Amber a private Rose business, someone? bro. Oh, no. It's a private business, bro. Oh. <laughs> still, still a little cringe reporting somebody? A little cringe. Reporting? Okay. That'll be the first person to report. I'll report the shit out of them. I don't care. Because I actually looked. I, I, did a quick, I did a search earlier before we started. He hasn't said the N-word, N-word once. He's a coward. He's waiting for people. Actually, now I'm curious people. if you actually put it in on Tumblr, if you will actually find it, or they don't allow that word. Because they do, like, block certain words from being used. No, no, no. There was uh, right two now. posts where uh, URLs with the Oh, my God, they are. are. They're, they're yeah. there. Holy mm-hmm. shit. Yep. Oh, my God. Dude, there was some, like, old, like, joke video. Like, Holy when shit. Band. I think College Humor did something to where they're, like... Like there was like Nazi, like Nazi shit that was still on mm-hmm. on Tumblr, which still is, you know, right? Mm-hmm. Shout out to our, our our fellow Nazis. There's there's right. like a like a fetish blog that like you can find pretty quick. It's just the N word in like three different variations. Like I came in like like um. There's there's a blog called Real mm-hmm. Swag, and the tags are mm-hmm with with one G and an A. Mm-hmm, hard R. Mm-hmm, with two G's and A. Jeez. Night, real, mm-hmm, uh, beautiful, spelled wrong, and girls on girls. But it's not even, like, porn. It's just, like, hitting a hookah. Interesting. There's, there's, like, those, like, really, like, really lazy, like, offensive memes that have, like, no comedic sense, and even them being offensive isn't funny. Yeah. There, I'm surprised this kind of humor is still on here. Yeah, it's few and far between. But uh I guess we'll get uh we get ready to wrap it up here. So any final thoughts for today's episode? Tonight's episode. Uh we, we didn't touch on anything for more like ten minutes yeah, outside of you guys talking was... about your mass conspiracies. So this was this was a pretty uh Yeah, pretty good for you. This is filler. This is filler. <laughs> this, this I don't even call this filler. This is like background noise a little bit until until uh you know, we started talking about Matt blowing my back well, out again. You know? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Maybe this will be background noise, and some of our viewers will create will procreate a child, and they'll name. If it you do, um, I have the right to the name the child. Joke. The child's name is going to be named Yim. They're going to think the kid's yeah. Chinese. Kid won't be Chinese. Be South African based. All right, well, guys, thank you for uh, coming on, and then whoever the few people that are watching. Uh, thanks for joining and not asking questions because I don't think we could handle it today. And then to everybody else, catch you next time. Go fuck yourself. Dude.